Ezekiel 37. The hand of the Lord was upon me and carried me out in the spirit of the Lord and set me down in the midst of a valley which was full of bones and he caused me to pass round about and behold they were very many in the open valley and lo they were very dry and he said unto me son of man can these bones live and I answered O Lord God thou knowest again he said unto me prophesy upon, upon these bones and say unto them O ye dry bones hear the word of the Lord and thus saith the Lord God unto these bones behold I will cause breath to enter into you and you shall live and I'll lay sinews upon you and bring flesh upon you cover you with skin and put breath in you and you shall live you shall know that I am the Lord so I prophesied as I was commanded and as I prophesied there was a noise and behold a shaking and and the bones came together bone to bone and I beheld low sinew and flesh came upon them and skin covered them above and but there was no breath in them then said he unto me prophesy unto the wind prophesy son of man and say to the wind thus saith the Lord God come from the four winds O breath and breathe upon these slain that they may live so I prophesied as he commanded me and breath came in unto them and they lived and stood upon their feet an exceeding great army then said and he said unto me, Son of man, these bones are the whole house of Israel. Behold, they say, our bones are dried, and our hope is lost, and we are cut off from our parts. Therefore prophesy and say unto them, Thus saith the Lord God, Behold, O my people, I will open your graves, and cause you to come up out of your graves, and bring you into the land of Israel and you shall know that I am the Lord when I have opened your graves O my people and brought you out of your graves and shall put my spirit in you and you shall live and I shall place you in your own land then you shall know that I the Lord have spoken it and performed it saith the Lord now